Hello, Brother WWE. Welcome to the WWE News Now channel. Thank you to all of our channel subscribers and if you are a loyal WWE brother, I invite you to subscribe to our channel, and if you like the video leave your like. See now the results of WWE NXT for January 17, 2023 directly from the Capitol Wrestling Center in Orlando, Florida. Four of NXT most athletic and dynamic superstars face off as Apollo Crews and Axiom team up against Carmelo Hayes and Trick Williams. Each superstar showcased his brilliant attack with a series of acrobatic aerial moves and double strikes. Hayes had Cruz in the middle of the ring, but when he went for the baton, Cruz hit back with a strong jab to seal the impressive victory for him and his duo. One of the fastest growing superstars in all of NXT, Sol Ruka was in search of his big moment, and he ended up running into Alba Fire. Fire's skillful tatami trick threw the ultra sporty Ruka off balance, but Isla Dawn emerged and distracted Fire, making it possible for Ruka to hit the devastating Soul Snatcher and win the fight. Mark Coffey and Wolfgang made their shocking return to NXT last week knocking out Brooks Jensen and Josh Briggs backstage and replacing them during the tag team gauntlet match, so the duo Jensen and Briggs wanted to settle the score with Coffey and Wolfgang, the fight turned into a blunt affair when Jensen bore the brunt of the damage, with him absorbing a backdrop on the exposed floor outside the ring. Briggs was unable to beat Gallus who with a combo of kicks to the head gave Coffey and Wolfgang the victory. One of Chase U top students, Thea Hale, embarks on a confrontation with Valentina Furas in hopes of beating her. When the two superstars are fighting in the ring, Electra shows up and tries to give Furas a pair of brass knuckles, but she refused to use them, and that moment of hesitation led Hale to recover and manage to hit her with a face destroyer and give her her first win of her young NXT career. Tyler Bate made his return to NXT, but was met with a fight against Javier Bernal, even with Bernal efforts, Bade is able to land precision strikes including an uppercut from the second rope and also a suplex, midway through the match Bernal is able to counter the Tyler driver 97 twice, but Bate ends up walking away with the win. NXT Women's Champion Roxanne Perez, teamed up with Lyra Valkyria to defeat Toxic Attraction, after they attacked Valkyria earlier in the show. After Toxic Attraction used their tandem offense to take out Perez, Valkyria finally managed to even the fight, but Cora Jade appeared and the two fought out, leaving Perez with Gigi Dolan e JC Jane in the ring, at this point when Jane was preparing a big boot, she seemed to accidentally hit Doran, allowing Perez to knock her out of the ring. Perez would hit the pop rocks on Doli thus walking away with the victory. Tell me in the comments, what you liked most about last night's NXT.